Kristen and welcome back to 100 baby we are here with Gracie and the one and only Izzy fabulous you guys I am so excited to see Izzy in game sims mobile peeps you know what's up oh my gosh can you imagine if Izzy attempted to be like one of the next baby daddy Gracie <laughs> that's me oh my gosh Gracie calm yourself okay so we did get an introduction with Izzy let's do yell at uh, no, let's continue. Let's just ask Izzy about his interest because I definitely do want to work on something a little romantic with Izzy for the future. Yes, go to high school. What about you? Go to school and you are going to school. So after the last episode, you guys, I did have Ken and Casper kind of work on their skills so that they can possibly be promoted at school today. Oh, Gracie, come back over here. Compliment appearance. I feel like he would really enjoy that. Oh my gosh. Are you one of the newbies? <gasps> I think you are one of the new members. So if you guys have added any new male sims to the gallery. Oh my gosh. What happened to Gracie? <laughs> she kind of sunk down in the road. But let's. Everybody's sleeping here. Okay. I'm kind of like just trying to catch up with everything you guys. Let's get some leftovers. So if you guys did upload any of your mail sims into the gallery using the hashtag KMXO100Baby, I did just go ahead and add in like eight new sims. So I will be including which sims I added at the end of today's video. So definitely check that out and continue to add any mail sims because it's just kind of something that I do randomly add into the game as we kind of like work our way through our babies. So we did just have the twins in the last episode. We have Nelly and Nicole. So I'm going to have to like start getting to know their names. <laughs> so we did have them. Now hopefully we are going to have the vampires possibly get promoted today. Hopefully they will be able to move out and we can continue on um, working on getting another baby daddy. So Let's have Mason come over. Um, we're going to get you to work on some of your skills. And we are going to get Molly. Is she stuck? What the heck? Go here. You are not stuck. What are you doing? Go here. You are not stuck. What is going on? Teleport here. Yes. <laughs> let's just get you out of there you can come over crawl through so we definitely do need to get working on molly and mason's potty skills so i did actually go ahead and buy us a bunch of new potties because for some reason when i did the renovation i deleted out a bunch of the potties and um yeah so i just kind of put them there i didn't want to add them upstairs so originally I was going to be like, oh, this is the big bathroom. Let's put it up there. But it's just such a hassle to get toddlers upstairs. And we still have these two rooms, which I really want to know what you guys think we should add in there. Let's just ignore them. I'm kind of thinking about making another bedroom right here, same as we have downstairs, but for a boy and maybe making this like a teen hangout kind of area. So let me know what you guys think of that Gracie okay Gracie you're gonna need to come in repair this oh gosh who's in trouble okay <laughs> didn't even want to read it and ooh, we need to let's randomize this pose these poses are kind of getting on my nerves a little bit we keep getting like really ridiculous cut off poses I like being able to see everybody that is in the family and I kind of think it's because we have so many like babies and toddlers that everybody like needs to hold one. Okay, I think that's going to be like the best that we can get. So Gracie, we need to go check out and see how the money tree is doing in all of our other garden stuff. So I really hope that we will be able, oh, we can sell it. Okay, so one of these days, you guys, I really hope that we do get the, um, harvest so that we can continue on making more money let's talk to the plant how are the bees let's just bond with those and we can come out and harvest the plasma fruit oh we probably should weed all of these as well oh my gosh gracie needs to pee how bad okay we have a little bit of time left and we do have eleven thousand simoleons so 
Oh no, we have a crying baby. Okay, we're gonna have to wait. Dang it. We're gonna feed you. And let's feed you. And can we do super efficient baby care? Okay, Gracie, hurry up, come in. Oh God, she is probably gonna pee her pants <laughs> by the time she is done with these babies, but I guess that's fine. We don't really have another option. So I really do not want to have like any of these babies taken from us. Okay, so we have the baby no longer crying and we need to actually hire some services. So I think what we are going to do is hire a gardener. I think that'll really come in handy with like the weeding, watering, and hopefully it will like kind of work towards getting us to be able to evolve. Oh my gosh, I thought I'd just seen we can evolve this one. Ooh, we can do actually quite a few. So I haven't really been wasting too much time over here with these plants, but for some reason they seem to actually be doing really good. <laughs> kind of strange. And, oh, we can't do that one. Oh, we can do this one. And what about this one? No. Okay, Holly is back over. Oh my gosh, Holly seriously just like loves being here you to crawl through Gracie's hard work okay so we have been evolving those so I wonder if Holly will be able to help potty train let's get her to do that Holly you need to like get off the computer <laughs> what the heck are you doing now Gracie did she go pee yes okay perfect let's get you to come over sell the money fruit and let's harvest those and then we will weed those so I think we are going to hire let's go over oh my gosh hire a service so I think we are going to hire a butler again so as soon as I do that I just need to remember to actually make sure that they don't help out with the children and then we do need to hire a gardener and I think that's all we can actually do for today oh my gosh Molly where are you going? Oh, we're going to Babel. Okay, so let's check on their skills. So we are working towards getting all of the kids' skills to a level three, so we will be able to age them up. So we are gonna need to get working on communication. So, oh, just go away, no. <laughs> let's go over into the playroom area. Let's just get you to do a bunch of babbling so we can get the communication up. Grace is busy, so you're gonna have to come inside here. Let's skip this one. Let's work on communication. We're probably going to do communication and imagination today. And oh my God, he is doing so good, but we are missing one of the skills. Um, Thinking, movement, potty. Oh, potty. Okay, so we're going to need to get him working on the potty skill. So for now, I think we should probably get you to come in and play dolls until Gracie is finished. And then we will be able to, oh, there's our money. <laughs> so I definitely want to hear what you guys think we should be building upstairs because we finally do have 20,000 simoleons. So we definitely will be able to furnish these two rooms right here. And we probably could even like buy a new computer as well. Okay, so we are going to be doing, first let's hire a butler. And then we are going to need to hire another service. I think we already have a maid, so we're just going to need to do the gardener. Okay, so while we're moving weeds, Gracie found a frog. Oh my gosh, yes. Okay, so we are going to be hiring, or do we already have a gardener? One time scheduled gardening service. Okay, there we go. And we could put the frog, oh my gosh, where are we going to put this thing? <laughs> Uh, we could put it, I guess, upstairs in one of the children's rooms if it's not going to fit. Oh, it did. Okay. Oh, and we do have a bunch of other stuff here. So let's get some of these books put away. We have so many toys. Oh my gosh. And we do have the dragon fruit. And what do we have in here? Oh, this is really cute. Where could we put that oh we need to take care of our baby change dirty diaper um we 
don't really have that many shelves so that might be something that we do kind of work on adding in the future i guess we could put our snow globe right here that's kind of cute i guess <laughs> we have like so much stuff oh my gosh all right so we do have our new butler so we are gonna have to make sure that we management responsibilities stop attending to minors so we need to make sure that he has nothing to do with the children and stop gardening, repairing, cleaning, start. No. Okay. So let's set the bedroom right here. Oh my gosh. It is so dingy. <laughs> I kind of forgot about this little like lost room. So I think we might have to work on that. Oh my God. It is three o'clock already. So we do have Casper who has been working. He is an A student. Levi is a B and Ken is an A student. <gasps> Where are they? They are going to be able to have a birthday. Do we even have a cake in here? Let me open this up. Oh, we ate it. Okay, so Gracie, you are going to need to come in here and let's just do a chocolate cake. Oh my gosh, you guys. So we are going to be able to say goodbye to the vampires. So we definitely do need to get Gracie working on becoming pregnant once again. So I think what we are going to be doing is actually going to the neighbors, introducing ourselves because we do have a bunch of new male sims that have moved in that you guys have added into the gallery. So we do need to go over and make friends with them. And we also are probably going to have to go to Forgotten Hollow and possibly have a baby with Vlad. <laughs> so flood out the comments letting me know where you think Gracie should start working on the next baby dad. And we also do need to get Levi aging up as well. So let's get Levi to do homework. Oh my gosh. You need to go in here and use. So we need one more skill to a level four. Oh, creativity. Okay, so let's get you to come in here and draw... Um, let's do a vehicle today and we could probably do some shapes as well. So 76%. Okay. Yes. Oh my God. I'm so glad we finally have a butler that is cleaning. Okay. Gracie, do not take a bite of this. We need to add our birthday candles and we are going to be sending Casper fly here and you are going to need to blow out those candles. So we are going to be saying goodbye to the vampires, but you guys, this is definitely not the last time we will be seeing vampires in our household. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, we should probably get you to come over here as well. So Casper has aged up, so we need to choose another random trait. And art lover. Okay. And Gracie, quickly add birthday candles. Oh my gosh, the butler. Oh, he already like loves our family. <laughs> so put some more birthday candles, Gracie. And we are going to be having Ken come over and blow out the candles. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, all right. So yeah, let me know if you guys would like to see us possibly have another pregnancy with a vampire. And if you think we should have it with Vlad or just another random kind of vampire oh my gosh okay so we need to choose another random trait oh dog lover that's strange <laughs> i definitely don't picture vampires to be like dog lovers but let's go ahead add some birthday candles actually we can just get him to put some birthday candles gracie Okay, and let's put that away because we might need that in a next coming episode for Levi. Ooh. <laughs> what the heck? Okay, so we do have the two vampires that have completely aged up. They are ready to move out. And I think what we are going to do... Ooh, the Spice Festival. <gasps> Gracie. I kind of feel like we should maybe have Gracie go to the Spice Festival because we have not gone there yet. So we did go to the Romance Festival. Let's do some extra credit work. And okay, you are going to be busy with that. Babies are fine. And oh, <laughs> it's like they read my mind. Okay, so let's come in here, bottle feed both of the babies. 
before we have Gracie go anywhere. So we're gonna do that. And Levi's busy. Okay, Molly, what about you? Molly has gone to bed. She is hungry. So let's open this up. Let's get the kids some food before we do go anywhere. So let's just put this here. You can come over, grab a serving, and let's get Mason to come over, grab a serving as well because everybody is getting so hungry. Oh my gosh, are you starving? <gasps> oh my gosh. Mason, come over, get some food, and then we can get Mason to actually go back to bed and we can get Molly to go back to sleep as well. Mason, no, you need to come over here and get some food. This is very important. And Molly has reached level three now as well. Did I hear a baby crying? No, okay. <laughs> so we're gonna have Gracie go over and visit the residence alone because I do wanna go make over some friendly introductions to the neighbors and possibly start some relationships because in the next episode, you guys, we are gonna be able to have two more babies and um, kind of hoping we don't have twins <laughs> because it does get a little bit um, awkward and hard to manage. So there are eight Sims living over here. We have one, two, three, four, five. Oh, there must be a few that have gone to work. <gasps> Ooh, let's do a friendly introduction and friendly, friendly, <laughs> friendly introduction. So many new Sims. You guys might even recognize them if you submitted them. And can we like go inside? Knock on the door. Ooh, who's over here? Ooh, oh my gosh, she is so pretty. Who is this? <gasps> Gracie needs to have a friend. We need to get her to come over and give an introduction. I mean, she might even be able to start introducing us to some guys as well. And who is this? We have Wyatt Brown. Ooh, oh my gosh, so much is going on. <laughs> so, okay, Gracie's going over to introduce herself. And then we are going to knock on the door. I don't think anybody else is in here. And I kind of feel like this home also needs a little bit of a renovation as well. So let me know if you guys see any of the Sims here that you kind of want Gracie to zoom in on. So we have James and we have Benny. Then over here we have Cooper and we have Adam. Oh my gosh, I kind of like Adam, but then there's like James. <laughs> I'm not too sure. Okay, so we did introduce ourselves. Okay, we don't need to chat. We are going to come over. Oh, who is this? Looks like a pizza delivery. She is leaving. Okay, so we have made a bunch of new friends. So I think we're going to have Gracie possibly go back home. Ooh, who's over here? <gasps> Stuck up snotty Thorn Bailey is back. I mean, ask for a selfie, ask for an autograph. Um, Attempt an introduction again. I mean, he is just so full of himself. In real life, I would stay far away from this kind of person. But because that is Gracie, I definitely picture this as a challenge. Oh God, he's like already annoyed that we want to. Um, <laughs> that's awkward. We kind of, we seen that. You didn't even try to hide it. They have no furniture in here. Well, that's a shame. We need to renovate this home for these guys. <laughs> All right, so we have Thorn. Let's see how this is gonna go. Gracie, stop screaming. Control yourself. <laughs> oh my gosh, Gracie, ask for a selfie. We don't really wanna ask for a hug or anything. Let's ask for a selfie, I guess. Is he leaving? Maybe he doesn't want to ask for a selfie. Um, take Ask for an autograph. Oh, he's gone. He wants no part of it. Okay, well, Gracie, we are going to send her back home all by herself. Now, we do have a bunch of new connections. So I kind of am thinking even having Gracie go out on like a double date or something like that. Let me know who you guys think we should invite over for a date. We also have Izzy and I need to like see if we have already been introduced to Vlad. I can't remember if we went to Forgotten Hollow or not. 
Let's see, we have Benny. Okay, all of the new ones are there. We have Izzy, Gabe, Felicia. <gasps> you guys! Dream passed away and I never even knew that. Oh my God. I don't even know how we could have forgotten about that. We have Aaron. So many people have passed away. There is Caleb and Bear. Okay, so we might even have to make, like I said, a trip to Forgotten Hollow to make some more vampire friends. If you guys would like to see more vampires in this series. So are we hungry? Oh God, he just took our food. Let's get leftovers. Yeah, put the food away. What the heck are you doing? <laughs> okay, Gracie is also going to need to clean up a little bit. So let's get her to have a shower. The babies are calm. We should probably feed them before we go to sleep as well. Now, how is Levi making out? Okay, so Levi has already gone to sleep. Ken, oh, they're probably going to need to go out. Oh, gosh. We don't want a cranky vampire. <laughs> Let's get them to go out and sleep. And who else do we have here? So we do have Molly. Molly has gone to bed. Where are you sleeping? Okay, she's over there. And Mason. Oh my gosh, Mason is like completely exhausted. So they're definitely going to need to have some baths in the morning. Gracie is getting some food here as well. And I think that is where we are going to end today's episode of 100 Baby, you guys. Oh my gosh, he's literally shoveling that in. <laughs> he's like starving to death. But we are going to be saying goodbye to Casper and Ken. So like I said, let me know if you guys want to see more vampires added. I definitely want to see some aliens. So if you guys do want to add some aliens into the save file, add them using the hashtag KMXO. 100 baby make sure to give this video a very big thumbs up and hopefully i'm gonna see you all next time bye guys okay so going through pages and pages of the hashtag kmxo 100 baby in the gallery i did include eight new sims so the following creators are those that i have chosen for this time's additions or these are going to be the new neighbors in 100 baby so huge thank you to my june Laura Pixie, Evan and Zoo, Lorak, Asher Angio, Samorak3, Gen Corp72. I am completely positive I have mispronounced pretty much every single one of them. But you can still upload your Sims to the gallery. Hashtag KMXO, and I will see you all next time. Bye guys!